Hi everyone, in this video we are going to integrate tangent cube of x. For this integration it's useful to know tangent squared of x equals to secant squared of x minus 1, which is derived from this identity below. Let's start. As our first step, we are going to break tangent into tangent squared of x times tangent x dx. Now we can utilize our identity for tangent squared of x. So tangent squared of x equals to secant squared of x minus 1. And we have tangent x outside here dx. Now we are going to do normal u substitution. u is our secant x. So what is du? What is the derivative of secant x? Derivative of secant x is secant x tangent x dx. If you solve for dx here, you're going to get du over secant x times tangent x. Now let's place in terms of u. We have u here, u squared minus 1. We have tangent x here. Instead of dx, we're going to write times du over secant x times tangent x. Tangent x's cancel out, and we know that secant x is our u, so instead of secant x, we can write u as well. Now let's simplify. It's going to be u squared minus 1 over u du. Now we're going to break this fractions into two fractions. We're going to separate it. So u squared over u minus 1 over u du. So from this step to that step, all we did was to separate the fraction. Let's simplify. u squared divided by u is u minus 1 over u du. Now we can finalize the integration because we know the antiderivative of each piece. What is the antiderivative of u? It is 1 half u squared minus what is the antiderivative of 1 over u? It is ln absolute value of u plus c. Now we are going to bring u back. What was u? u was secant x. So we are going to rewrite it as secant squared x minus ln of secant x plus c. This is the final answer. If you wish, you can substitute negative ln secant of x with positive ln cosine of x. This is the end of the video. Thank you for watching. See you at the next video.